Hello and welcome back to Movie Flakes, home of movies, where we show, reviews and BR downs. So if you really wanna be in the show, sit tight and don't go anywhere, Movie Flakes has got you. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and comment for more spoilers. Again if you wanna participate in new Funko Pop challenge of fire and blood, like, subscribe and comment, who you really wanna be king and the winner will be announced on 28 October. Before wasting much of your time, let's get back to secrets behind Damon's sword. We shall answer all these questions in our discussion. How did Game of Thrones' dark sister fare? What happened to Damon's dark sister in House of the Dragon? And finally how Damon got the black sister in House of the Dragon. A Damon weapon is a powerful piece of chaos art, a blasphemous fusion of the spirit and substance of the materium. The ruinous powers typically presented as a gift to their chosen mortal minions. A daemon weapon is, as its name suggests, a weapon that has been imbued with the essence of a chaos daemon. Although daemonic ranged weapons have been discovered, daemon weapons are mostly close ranged weaponry. The daemon is frequently trapped inside the weapon as a result of a punishment meted out by its patron chaos god. But occasionally, extraordinary mortal servants of chaos succeed in persuading a daemon to aid them in their murderous adventures. And the daemon voluntarily bonds with its bearer. A sentient object that bestows great power on its user is a daemon weapon. Nearly all daemon weapons give their carriers access to their daemonic senses, enhancing their perception of their environment. The weapon itself is frequently quite destructive in and of itself. If its confinement hasn't rendered the bound daemon insane, it can also advise or even control the carrier. There are bound Tzintkian daemons, and the daemon voluntarily bonds with its bearer. A sentient object that bestows great power on its user is a daemon weapon. Nearly all daemon weapons give their carriers access to their daemonic senses, increasing their perceptions, and making them particularly fond of and apt at this. The weapon itself is frequently highly damaging in and of itself. The mere possession of a daemon weapon confers great honor upon the servants of the ruinous powers and is regarded as a true sign of the favor of the god. The bearer will quickly notice an increase in the size of their personal flock of eager followers. However, this power comes at a risky cost. The bound daemon has no regard for human limitations or frailties. If the carrier is unable to handle their weapon, they will be killed as soon as the weapon locates a more suitable candidate wielder, which is frequently accomplished through the daemon weapon's ingenious scheme of withdrawing support at a crucial juncture. In House of the Dragon, Daemon Targaryen uses the ancestral Targaryen blade Dark Sister, which will later be linked to the Game of Thrones character Bran Stark. The Targaryen family transported the weapons over before the Doom of Valyria, and Dark Sister is merely one of the Valyrian steel weapons in the possession of the Targaryen characters during House of the Dragon. Along with his Valyrian steel knife and King Viserys blade Blackfire, the weapon of Daemon Targaryen in Targaryen history, both before and after the House of the Dragon's rule, Dark Sister had a crucial role. Through the usage of House Targaryen's arsenal of Valyrian steel weaponry, House of the Dragon has already hinted to another significant Game of Thrones connection. The Valyrian steel catspaw dagger used to try to kill Bran Stark in Game of Thrones Season 1 is shown in the custody of King Viserys I Targaryen and subsequently Alicent Hightower. Following that, the uncommon Valyrian steel dagger made a few more appearances, most notably when Arya Stark used it to defeat the Night King and save the living, a plotline. Aegon I Targaryen's true identity has been revealed in House of the Dragon Recons, a dream from Song of Ice and Fire. Daemon's sword Dark Sister will thereafter have a connection to King Bran Stark, also known as the Three-Eyed Raven, as each Valyrian steel weapon owned by House Targaryen will appear to play a significant part. Lysnia Targaryen, the sister wife of Aegon the Conqueror who was instrumental in capturing Westeros, was the original owner of Dark Sister. Dark Sister was passed down through House Targaryen generations, until ending up in the hands of King Viserys I Targaryen's younger brother Daemon, just like Aegon's blade Blackfire. Brynden Rivers, who is commonly regarded in the Game of Thrones books to be the original Three-Eyed Crow, acquires control of Dark Sister a number of decades after Daemon's passing. He is therefore also regarded as the Three-Eyed Raven in the Game of Thrones television series. When Brynden joined the Night's Watch and eventually took over as the Three-Eyed Raven, it's thought that he brought Dark Sister with him. What happened to Daemon's Dark Sister in House of the Dragon? Since Aegon's conquest, the Dark Sister is only known to have had seven wielders, starting with Vaisnia. She then gave her son Meager the Cruel, who Daemon is compared to in the first episode of House of the Dragon, the sword, although he eventually decided to use his father's Blackfire instead. After his captor mother took it from Dragonstone, Dark Sister later became King Yheri's I Targaryen's sword. 
How did Game of Thrones Dark Sister fare? In Game of Thrones, Dark Sister's whereabouts are a mystery. Over 60 years before Game of Thrones, Brynden Rivers, also known as Bloodraven, was dispatched to the Night's Watch and is said to have brought Dark Sister with him. But in 252 AC, he vanished beyond the wall, and it is unknown if he was carrying the blade at that time. The sword may still be maintained in the cave where the original three-eyed raven lived if he did bring Damon's dark sister sword with him beyond the wall. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more videos.